Good morning. I am Dr. K. Udayakumar, Assistant Professor, Department of Defense and Strategic Studies, Gurunana College, Chennai. So now we are going to discuss about the marine environment as a component of India's national security. A special reference to Gulf of Mannar. Indian Ocean is the warm water oceans. Like uh, always, all the during seasons, Indian Oceans they like warm water. Uh, trade route in the waters, all the during session, uh, all the ship going and coming there, uh, Indian Oceans, uh, military exercise, cargo ship sailing on, on it is water. It is uh, located strategically in the world. Any country they want the uh, go trade, uh, touch the Indian Ocean. Uh, the world uh, strategi strategically located is very important all over the world. So this is the Indian Ocean map. You can see the very uh, important place of the world. The any country they want the uh, trade or going and coming any uh, purpose, they definitely touch the Indian Ocean. This is the uh, uh, trade route. You can see that we we are easily understand the trade route. You can see the any country they want uh, going or coming they definitely touch the indian ocean uh, indian ocean is the very important ocean the strategically located in the world so this is a uh, 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 getting very high polluted pollution of the ocean will affect the marine environment marine resource uh, many things affected from the uh, pollution indian ocean is the marine environment the study attempt to make an effort into the identifying the analyzing marine environment as india's national security the general phenomena the blue economic we are called for the blue economic oceans we are getting from the many uh, resource from the uh, oceans like the coastal population depend on the total uh, total their livelihood the india we have the total nine uh, coastal states the people depend on the livelihood totally and the fisheries india's long coastal lines india we have the total uh, 7516 uh, kilometer uh, land based resource fastly depleting that's why the people they want the uh, more focus in particularly the ocean resource ocean this is a uh, deep sea exploration the world they can uh, very developed science and technology we can do the anything in uh, inside of the ocean this is a deep sea exploration possible uh, well developed the science and technology so i am going to the discuss about the especially the gulf of mannar gulf of mannar is uh, located in the pathway region they have the pound total 3600 pieces flora and fauna this is a total four district touch the Tudukuran, Tirnalveli, Kanyakumari, Ramnathapuram district. Total they having the 21 highland, the cover. This is the Gulf of Manar uh, has been declared Marine Reserve Park in uh, 1986 by the Indian government. The reserve is 180 kilometers long and 10 kilometers wide with the 21 island. It is the first marine biosphere reserve in the Southeast Asia. It has the largest sea based and variety of sea grows in the ton and the feeding ground in the endangers. The Gulf of Manar this is a map. They are having the total 21 island. The 21 island is a very important. Why this is a, we are uh, connecting the uh, India's national security? So they are having the rarely pieces. Indian government in the 1986 they declared the um, National Bio Reserve Park. They are having the rarely pieces uh, like the coral reefs. Dagam, CRs, sea cow, many rarely pieces the available in particularly this region Gulf of Mannar. Uh, we are uh, taking from the uh, coral reefs, we are uh, take the medicine from the coral reefs, uncured disease we are using the medicine like this. You can see this map also they having the total 21 island, the 21 island they divided the four group, four group one is the Mandabam group, Kedakara group, Wamban group, Group. They are having the, some uh, island debated in the port group. They want the maintenance in particularly security issue. They debated the port group. So this is the one island of 
உப்பு தண்ணி ஐலேண்ட் யூ கேன் சி த வெரி பியூட்டிஃபுல் ஐலேண்ட் வி வாண்ட் த சேவ் அண்ட் செக்யூரிட்டி இன் பர்டிகுலர்லி திஸ் ஐலேண்ட் வி ஆர் கெட்டிங் ஃப்ரம் த லாட் ஆஃப் ரிசோர்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் எக்கனாமிக் எவ்ரி திங் வி ஆர் கெட்டிங் ஃப்ரம் த ஓஷன்ஸ் தட்ஸ் ஒய் வி வாண்ட் த சேஃப் அண்ட் செக்யூரிட்டி வி ஆர் கிவிங் த மோர் அட்டென்ஷன் மோர் செக்யூரிட்டி எஸ்பெஷலி திஸ் ஐலேண்ட் ஸோ ஐ வில் கோயிங் டு த எக்ஸ்ப்ளனேஷன் ஒன் பீசிஸ் கோரல் ரிப்ஸ் கோரல் ரிப்ஸ் த பெனிஃபிட் this is a protection of coastal environmental soil erosions you can see the coral reefs they want the safe and security especially soil erosions we are the uh, p- preservation biodiversity fishing industry supports the especially the coral reefs the uh, more uh, fish breeding grown the fish they want the uh, getting more benefit from the coral reefs we are getting from the uh, adhesion from the uh, coral reefs this is a tourism support the coral reefs advancement in the medical research we are getting from the uh, medicine from the coral reefs this is the one pieces you can see the total we have the 3600 pieces in particularly the uh, gulf of mannar you can image this is a sample of the one uh, pieces of coral reefs the uh, conclusion there should be a uh, strict application polluter pay uh, principal pay on the one time fees to cover the cost of administration supervision mass education the environmental matter and essential in order to improve the environmental eco- ecology and the coastal region if uh, who are the going to the polluted in the especially the coastal region we want the uh, giving the strictly uh, um, punishment and uh, some collecting uh, penalty so we are uh, giving the more attention to especially the Uh, coastal area coastal area we, we are getting the many benefit from the uh, all over the world this is a very important topic especially the national security okay thank you